All right, so here we go. We're putting the uh, PBR panels on. These come in this Galvalume stuff. It looks pretty good. I mean, it's cheap. The cheapest way out was the Galvalume. I was going to get painted ones, but they were like a dollar more a foot. dollar and a quarter more a foot. So I mean, that adds up real quick. It'd be like $400. So it's like uh, the cost of that was like not worth it to me because I can paint them. This is actually, I don't know what kind of galvanized this is. It's galvalume. It looks different than regular galvanized, but it doesn't look quite like, uh, uh, you know, paint lock galvanized. So I don't know. I'll have to do a paint sample on it, see if it sticks. But we go ahead and just put the screws in down here down in the middle, put them in the flat areas here. Um, we'll put one here after we put this panel underneath. And, uh, that's the tricky part is actually doing the sides. The roof part's easiest. And so you could even make just an awning if you wanted to with this, but I really wouldn't trust it because this thing without the sides, it's a bit rickety. But once you get the sides in there and the end, it should be pretty rigid. And then we're gonna add some supports as needed. Like I said, there's we're probably gonna end up putting a conduit piece from here to there, you know, from here to there. And then the same thing there all the way down. And then the center, we're going to put like a, a ceiling joist in there or a rafter in there. So we're going to put a small rafter, but I want it up higher because if, you know, to make it the strongest, you should put your rafter from here somewhere near the bend over and that would be the strongest, but I need it to, I need the extra clearance. So I'll put it up higher. All right. I'll talk to you in the next portion.